But this little guy is one of my favorite little cobras. Now, he's not a true cobra. He falls into genus Espitalaps. And they, it's what they call the coral cobra. Behave yourself. Just, it's like a chihuahua. He just feels like he needs to be big and bad. But he's actually, he's not a deadly bite, but he is uh, medically important, medically significant if he was to bite you. Now, this little guy is, again, not on exhibit yet because you probably wouldn't see him if he was on exhibit. Behave yourself. And, but he is, again, there's only two snakes, two species that fall into the genus of Spitalaps, and he's one of them. And the other one is the shield nose cobra. And these guys, again, are out of Africa. And all of your true cobras are out of Africa and Asia, Philippines, Indonesia, that area. There's no true cobras that, um, or any cobras even. Definitely makes up for it in attitude, don't you, buddy? Yeah. Gorgeous little snake, a spitalaps, not naya, falls into a completely different category. And now we're going to take you over to something that's on a grander scale of this guy, who's truly the king of all cobras. And I think you're going to see what I mean in just a second. You ready to go back up? I think you're ready.